Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I appreciate you being here. I have a day crate. I finally got one. I don't know which one it is. It might be April, it might be May, could even be March. I'm not really sure, but I did get one. So I'm here to open that with you. I did cancel this only because it was taking a while to get the boxes. Um, however, I am excited to see what comes in these and if they are like not able to live without them, then I will resubscribe. But for now I did cancel just because we're too behind on these and I wanted to kind of get caught up. Um, and for the fake crate, I believe I signed up for the Sealy crate, which comes with a t-shirt and let's see what the t-shirt is. Oh, that's really cute. Actually, it says we are all stardust and stories. I don't know what the fandom is on this, but it is very, very pretty. So there's that. I'll get you a close up if I can. So there's some keys there and looks like a B and there's the quote. Um, it's kind of giving me a little bit of um, dark academia and a little bit of fantasy vibes in there. I do like it. I did get a size large because I wasn't sure how their t-shirts run, so it may be a little big. Um, I typically, like, normally wear a regular large in women's, so this may be a little bit bigger, but that's okay. It's really cute. It's really pretty. Let's see what's next. We got a hat. I'm a hat person. I like wearing hats don't have a lot of hats but I do like them so this says Phoenix Rider I'm not really sure what the fandom is on this either I'm not good at fandoms I'm never going to be good at fandoms but there you have it so it is like that um like that weathered look on the hat so it's like a pinky red kind of color and it does have like an adjustable back so that's really cute not wearing like hair for a hat right now but I like it. So we got a hat. And next, I have what is, let's see, Fake Crate Exclusive Moray Shower Steamer Scented with Verbena. Inspired by, I am so blind. Scavage the Stars by Terrasim. Sorry, it takes me a while to focus. I am so blind. I am going to open this because I want to smell it. Oh my god. This smells really good. So it's like a pink foil with a little card on there. So I should have showed this to you before I opened it there. There you are. So we got some shower steamer. I'm assuming you just kind of open this and put it in the floor of your shower and kind of let it fizz out but it's a blue color and it smells amazing like this smells really good like heavenly like it smells good I do like this this smells amazing let's see what we got next all right exclusive wooden keychain inspired by the sound of stars by Alessia Dow I don't think I'm saying that right probably not but super super cute keychain and this says a book can change someone's world and I completely 100% agree with that let's take it out all right so there's nothing on the back but we do have this very cute wooden keychain so it is it's pretty thick so it's a good um good quality there nothing on the back just plain but very very cute I like that super different you can even color that in if you'd like like if you want some color in there, you could probably take some like permanent markers or something and color it in. That's really cute. I love it. All right. This says Fay Crate Apothecary Collection inspired by The Kingdom of Back by Marie Lou. So that's what the back says there. And it looks like a little acrylic stand. And this is super cool because... Um, I've actually received something very similar in a fake in a fairy loot box, which was this guy right here. 
Although I, eh, I broke his stand, but same thing. It's like a little acrylic stand with a character on it. I love these. I put them on my shelves. Super cool. They come with a little base. And then you just fit it in there. And she is so cute. She's like a little fairy. That's the back. So it's pretty much the same. It's just a little bit more visible. But this is their apothecary collection. And I really, really like this. It's different. It's very cute. Definitely going on my bookshelf. All right, next. Looks like we have a sticker. And it says, your impact matters more than your intentions. And I really like that. That is definitely something that um, everybody should take into consideration. So I like that. Be kind, basically be kind. All right. And this looks like, I'm guessing, I guess it could be an art print or a bookmark. It says you get to choose who you are and it's a little art print there. Okay. And this is a letter from the author. Did people just let dreams come true? Walk away? Wait, did people just let dreams come true? Walk away? I don't really, eh, am I not understanding that right? I don't know. Confusing to me, but maybe it's a book quote. I don't know. There you are. And it looks like there is a letter... From the author on the back there so I'll post that up so you can uh, pause if you want to see okay and looks like we have another art print here and this looks like also the spoiler card so very pretty artwork I like the pink okay let's see so this says Faye post Faye create secret of fate made okay so this is a may box so I think I'm still missing a box prior to this one so I don't think I've received my April box yet so this looks like it's the May box all right uh, let's see we are magic sticker so we got the sticker here never forget the impact you can have on the world with a sticker inspired by when we were magic okay and then we have our shower steamer it says enjoy the scent of moray with a shower steamer inspired by scavenge the stars okay what else our keychain here books have definitely changed our worlds carry that reminder from the sound of stars with this keychain and i do really like that keychain that's super cute i like it a lot all right and what's next our little stand so you have a little standee uh, da, 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 da. kingdom of black apothecary standee by at rollins for the first of our apothecary collection we have hyacinth in his most precious form by the ever amazing at rollins so i apologize this was a him not a her but it looks like a little bit of fey Let's see what else we got here. We have the Phoenix Rider Distressed Hat. It says, join the Phoenix Riders in their mission with a distressed hat inspired by Crown of Feathers by Nikki Palpreto. And I have not heard of that nor read that, but it's a very cute hat. And what else do we have here? This is, um, they're calling this a Polaroid. So that's really cute. Skyward Polaroid by at Acid Beta. Who would stop to take a selfie when the world is burning down? Severo. Severo World. And that's what that is. Okay. And the last but not least, the Starless Sea shirt at, um, this is by at reading.revelry. It says, even a shirt can be the key to another world. This beautiful shirt is inspired by the at Starless Sea. And this is Sealy and Solitary Crate. So this was a Sealy Crate. Cool. And then it has, wait a minute. Maybe this is April. I'm sorry. So it says May right here. But then it says April box. Um, so I'm guessing this is the April box. 
my apologies. So I've received the April box, not the May box. So the book of the month, I have received the signed book plate by the author. And the book of the month is Son of the Storm. And this is by Sui Davies Akongboa. Sorry if I mispronounced that. Let's see here what that. It says, a young scholar's ambition threatens to reshape an empire determined to retain its might in this epic tale of violent conquest, buried histories, and forbidden magic. Bay Crate exclusive edition with reversible dust jacket artwork by Therese Anderson at Warica underscore art. And then you get a free book download. So you get an ebook with this. It's called Fly with the Arrow by Sarah Wilson, a stolen bride, a terrifying bridegroom, the game that will determine their fates. So that says that right there. So you get a free ebook plus your book. Let's take a look. All right. So this is a really pretty cover. However, I'm just spoiled with fairy loot because my last fairy loot box, this is kind of you get really exclusive sprayed edges, sprayed stenciled edges, although I do still really like this cover here. It's really pretty. And it does have really good end paper artwork. So we have this here. Okay. Let's just take that dust jacket off for just a second. Do, 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 do. We got a little bit of insert writing in here. So not not a whole lot. Oh, we do got some maps in there. That's pretty cool. And we do have another in the back side. We do have some more artwork. So we do have the front. We do have some gold embossing on the spine. Nothing on the front or back. Let's check out this artwork. And then we have some artwork here on the reverse dust jacket. And then we have our author. And let's read really quickly what this book is about. It says, The can't miss epic fantasy of the year from a bold new voice. In the city of Basa, Donso is a clever scholar on the cusp of achieving greatness, only he doesn't want it. Instead, he prefers to chase forbidden stories about what lies outside the city walls. The Basi elite claim there is nothing of interest. The city's immigrants are sworn to secrecy. But when Danso stumbles across a warrior wielding magic that shouldn't exist, he puts, he's put on a collision course with Basa's darkest secrets. Drawn into the city's hidden history, he sets out on a journey beyond its borders, and the chaos left in the wake of his discovery threatens to destroy the empire. Cool. That sounds pretty neat. I really do like the items in this book. I'm not thrilled about like the book itself. It's just a book. And I'm only comparing this to my fairy loot books, my fae crate. Um, I'm sorry, my Illumicrate um, books. And, um, what else? Lit Joy Crate. So, those three boxes are a little bit more detailed when it comes to the actual book itself, which for me is the most important part of it. So, they do, the other book boxes do go into a lot more, um, detail, as you can see. Just to show you, they just kind of take a little bit more time with their books. You got some stenciled edging, some sprayed edges. Um, however, with that being said, the book itself does still sound very good and I'm absolutely going to read it, but I do really, really love this t-shirt design. So that's fantastic. I also really, really like this little apothecary collector's, um, kind of acrylic standy, if you will. I do like that. I think that's super cute. And... This smells, it smells so good. I'm legit probably gonna use this tonight. Mm. 
I can smell this forever. This smells really good. And so where they lack in book, they do make up for it in their items. I really do love the items they put in their in their box. We got like a cute hat, we got a little keychain, a really cool impact sticker. So overall, I really, really like the items in this box. Um, just a little tad bit disappointed about the time it's taken for the box to arrive. And also the book itself, there's not, I just don't see that much exclusive stuff about this book. Um, other than the actual like dust jacket, which is gorgeous. It's absolutely stunning. The artwork's amazing. I love it. The book sounds great. Um, but I just don't see a lot of, you know, special exclusive things about this book. But we do have a signed book plate for the author from the author. So that's really cool. Um, that seems to be about it. And I think I am, again, still waiting for another box to come in from them. So I'm guessing this was April. I'm still waiting for May, but there you have it. Overall, I like this box. I love all the items. They're unique. They're different. Um, even the items that smell, they smell really good. I like the little Polaroid pictures. They have a lot of different things in this box that other boxes don't have. So I do really like that. So um, I am excited to get my next box. And as soon as I get that, I will unbox it for you here. Let me know if you guys get fake right and what items that you liked in this box and which ones you did not like in this box. Um, yeah, let me know your thoughts and your feelings and all of that. And I appreciate you guys being here. Again, this is called Son of the Storm by Sweet Davies Akawangpo. So again, apologies if I pronounced that wrong, but this is going to be our book for April for Fake Crate. Thank you guys for watching this unboxing. I appreciate you and I hope you have a good rest of your evening. Bye!